you know what this sound means. Sun coming up, coffee going down. Back at it on this Saturday morning as always. Brought to you by Java Jake's Roastery. Brightening your morning one cup at a time. There's his info. Mentioned beans 316 for a discount. Today we're gonna do another one from Cornell and uh, Cornell and Deal. I believe it's called Insmith. Never had this one either. Uh, strange piece of jewelry. Seems blah blah blah. Virginia's Caterini Perique Black Cavendish. I love how they add the stories behind all these blends. And we're back. You can definitely smell the Orientals in this. I'm gonna get my pipe pack and give you my honest thoughts. We'll be right back. What's up, pipe smokers? Look at it. Excellent cigar. Out here with the wife today. 28th wedding anniversary, good lord. Here. Good. I have watermelon, he smoked. 28 long years. The best years of your life. <laughs> with the wife on the 28th wedding anniversary. Was you good luck, babe? So far, it's not too bad. The uh, Orientals, I thought, were going to take over the blend for short, judging by the smell out of the tin. Nice on the retro hail. Smoking this in my Asikian pipe. He's an artisan pipe maker from Armenia can find him on Facebook, I believe, and I know you can find him on Instagram. Look at it! Wife and I went out last, I believe last Sunday, I can't remember. Our anniversary was Monday. We've been married for 28 years now. And we went out during the middle of the day in the 90s. And I, she basically laid out and floated on the uh, raft. And uh, I played around with her a little bit and then I fished a little well. And I actually caught a catfish in the middle of the day like that. I was surprised. I said, you must have brought me good luck. I'll show a little clip of that. Uh, my granddaughter's six, six year birthday party. She's six years old today. She's having a birthday party today. I'm going to that early this afternoon. And after I'm done with that, 
I'm going back out on the river. So hopefully I'll have some more footage from that and hopefully catch some more. And a couple people were still asking me about pipes. I believe last I checked, I still had one or two left on eBay, uh, mortar pipes. Not gonna be making any today. This has just enough sweetness and just enough perique in it for me to keep me interested. I definitely want to smoke this in a cob now because this pipe is basically brand new. And, you know, I want to get a... Nice. You're getting a little bit of sour notes. Then it's like a little bit of musty. This is another nice blended tobacco with all the ingredients in it. You've had this and leave your thoughts below. This is a new tin from 24. A strange piece of jewelry sends you on a quest down the accursed and decrepit streets of Innsmouth, armed with the singular blends of Virginia, Caterini, Perique, and Black Cavendish. It's your duty to uncover the truth, the deep truth. <laughs> okay. Not a lot going on this week. It's still hot and humid here. It's probably most of the country. Yeah, I'd definitely buy this one again. Said I'm going to be placing an order for another round of hidden gems. Hopefully, I'll find a few. Still got some more tobaccos I want to get through. Maybe I might take this one with me today and review it out on the boat this evening. I'd definitely buy this one again. I'd want to age some too as well. Still got a lot of comments I'm going through having to, you know, get to answer everybody's comments. I will answer all of them. Just give me some time. Yeah, to me, there's just enough there to keep me interested in all the ingredients with this one. The, uh, Parique and the Orientals are definitely playing around with each other. I don't know how long this one's been out, but I believe it's the first time I've ever, ever tried this one. Definitely could be an all-day smoke for me. Hope everybody has a great weekend. I'll talk to you boys and girls later. Remember, whether you're a cigar lover, pipe smoker, whatever your belief, we're all brothers and sisters of the leaf.